Good day, Mr. Morgan. Would you be interested in some friendly competition? I've come all the way north from Mexico to challenge a real American gunslinger. You him? Me? Hey, a real gunslinger? <laughs> Let's find out. Okay, man. That's what I like to hear. Look, man, rules are simple, okay? Whoever shoots more of these bottles wins. Just draw your gun and aim when you're ready, all right? <laughs> Shoot! birds out of the sky first, wins. Simple enough? Stand near me, and as soon as they come out, it's anyone's shot. Be patient. Ah, there they go. Ah, man, stupid, stupid. Ah. So, you can shoot, huh? <laughs> ah, here it is, okay? Man of my word. Appreciate it. Sure. <sighs> Better watch out next time. You'll see. Just not your day, huh? Yeah, I guess not. Guess I need more practice.
Did the university send you? Excuse me? Because if they did, they can get lost. I have never been so insulted in all my life. Really, laugh death, balderdash. What are you doing? Are you quite certain you're not a spy? A spy? Those wretches will do anything to destroy me. My theories are correct, and I can prove it. What theories? I am the leading amateur paleontologist in the nation, and not one university will hire me because, unlike them, I actually have ideas. <laughs> You're a what? I study dinosaurs. You know, big lizards. Are they real? Of course they're real, you nincompoop. And everywhere... Everywhere? This state was once a vast, shallow sea that had the most incredible animal that could walk, swim, and fly. Quite unique. I call it Totalisaurus. Just for now. <laughs> um, I'm trying to gather all the evidence. Miss Deborah McGinnis? Arthur. Good to meet you. Uh, could you give me a hand here, please? Of course. Yeah. <clears throat> Listen. If you find any of these bones around the country, send them to my homestead at Burwood Rise in Cumberland Forest. Or mail me the locations. I'll reward you handsomely for your efforts. Sure. Why not? And we'll be proving a lot of stuck-up buffoons very, very wrong. Which, trust me, is the very best thing about science. Good day to you, sir! Good luck! I'll keep my eye out for you. Okay, boy. Let's go, boy. Get in. You should just be wandering around here, friend.
okay there. I just don't understand this at all. Hey, over here! What's the problem? Problem? No, there's no problem. Quite the contrary. Well, there is a problem. For me, but not for you. All right. <laughs> I ain't got time for no, this. No, well, no, wait! Give me a minute of your life. I might just change it forever. I'm sure you will have heard of me. Maximo Cristobal Valdespino, the renowned explorer. Can't say I have. There has been much written about me. I once had high tea with the Viceroy of India. I helped liberate South America. I've climbed mountains and swum across seas. I have had many women. I've spent the last three months hunting treasure on the American frontier. Beautiful country. Reminds me a lot of Almeria. But tomorrow I set sail for the island of Shikoku in the Japanese archipelago in search of the legendary Tokushima Sapphire. Hmm. Well, good for you. No, no, hold on. You see this map here? It was made by the Jack Hall gang. They robbed banks all the way from here to California. Yeah, I know who the Jack Hall gang are. Oh, them you have heard of, but me? Huh. Well, uh, rumor has it they buried gold somewhere in this area, but were killed before they could retrieve it. They created two maps to ensure it was well hidden. This is the first and should lead you to the second. You just need to follow the landmarks drawn here. Me? Yes! Unfortunately, I am out of time now, but I am prepared to sell it to you for the low price of... <gasps> Ten dollars. A trifling investment for a man such as you, given the potential returns. Well, ten dollars, and it's yours. You must think I was born yesterday. <clears throat> Between us, this map has proven a challenge even for me. So, how about I sell it to you for just five dollars? One half less. Uh, why the hell not? Nah, can't be that hard to suss out. Excellent! I don't think you will regret it. Good luck to you.
Yep. Mr. Morgan, I took your advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your god has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. No more shall I sink, sir. I am free. I am free. You don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. Sit down, Reverend. We ain't finished. You ain't finished. Look at him, he's finished. None of us force liquor down his throat, friend. I just want him to play. Now, firstly, we ain't friends. Don't make no mistake on that subject. Now, secondly, he can't hardly see, let alone reason. Now, reasoning ain't never been one of my strong points, neither, but seeing I do just fine. You want to step outside or do a business here? I just want him to finish the game. Why can't we all just get along? These are good men, Arthur. They're children of God. They are children of God. How's about you playing his place, huh? That seems fair. Fair? Sure. You want a game? Sure. I'll play a few hands. Well, sit yourself down, then. I'm Luther. This is Marvin. Fortunate for you both for being gentlemen about this. Same goes for you. So, how you two know each other anyway? Don't seem like the likeliest of friends, if you don't mind me saying. We go a long way back. And now you're his chaperone? I guess it's something like that. Can we play? Check. He can't be no real clergyman. <laughs> He committed about five cardinal sins just in that chair you're sitting in. I think he used to be. He's drifted a little in recent years. Life is a challenge to all of us. Huh. Can you imagine him at the pulpit? If he could stand up. On the fourth day, he turned water into whiskey, and I don't remember much after that. <laughs> Check. He's a decent fella going through a bad time. Disrespect him again, and you'll find yourself in a bad time, too. All right, all right. Just trying to have a little fun here. <laughs> it is a game, after all, mister. Not just a little wager. Good. Have a look at these. Hardly a big finale for me. Don't laugh. Mm-hmm. Could have been worse. Huh. Okay. Yes. <clears throat> this has been quite the eventful day. I reckon you're a serious player. <laughs> ah. Okay. 
Let's start this low for now. Uh... I'll call. Not for me. Here. I say bluff. You're bluffing. Good. I check. Screw it. Liar. Nah. All right, let's see him. How about that? Huh. Uh, yes. yes, that's it. Not much I can do about that. Ah, nice. No. That's the way it goes. Just shut up, will you? The people we've met at this table, huh, Marvin? Okay. Yeah. I'll uh, check. Gonna start small here. Okay, then. Um... No. How do you like this? There. Read him and weep. <laughs> Might be my day. Let's go. Ah. There we go. I'll take it. Better than nothing. Let's be brave, all in. Check. You should just go play checkers the amount you check. Oh, I think you're gonna regret that. Nah. Here we go. Damn it. All right, then. Mmm. I'll take it. I got bullshit. Okay. Oh, that's fair enough. 
Better than nothing. <laughs> Gentlemen, this is getting too rich for me. Sit down. Oh, I'm done, friend. It's been a real education. Come on, Rip. Where is he? Where'd he go? Who? The Reverend. Where is... <sighs> Excuse me, gentlemen. Reverend! Reverend Swanson! Where'd you go? Excuse me, I'm sorry. You, you see a drunken idiot, a priest, wandering about? Sure, we saw him, <laughs> smelt him, and avoided him. <laughs> he went that way, I think. Thanks. Guy looked kind of crazy, mister. Hey! What are you doing? Reverend! Mr. Morgan! A hand here, please! Hey! Calm down! The hell hey! Did you just Get say? your hands off you him! Say a word. You'll keep! You stay out of it! Get your hands off him now, you son of a bitch! What the hell is your problem? He's with me! You're... <clears throat> I won't Please, tell don't hurt me. I promise. On uh, second thoughts, you can give me all your money, too. Okay, here, just take it. Just, just please let me go. Wasting my time. Just get out of here. This never happened, okay? Reverend, get off the damn tracks! You crazy? Reverend, stop! Come on, my friend! It's just a simple mistake. You can still be saved. to like this place and wants to stay. Get your foot out of here! Twist your leg, you drunken bastard! Get it! Come on! You. What the hell is wrong with you? Throwing me off a bridge like there that? There was your goddamn train, you crazy bastard! <sighs> Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? I'm sorry. Uh, I wish I was different. <laughs> Let's get you home. Home? Yeah, that's a wonderful idea. I could have tea with Margaret. Margaret? Who's Margaret? What?
I was wondering when he'd show up. You better sleep your way to salvation, my friend. Oh, what happened? Just the usual. Poor bastard. Exactly. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll keep an eye on him. He was lucky this time. Real lucky. Hello, Arthur. Getting real low on meat here. Very good. We were getting low. Well, the quality's a bit lacking. We won't get much for it. Thank you, Arthur. <laughs> <laughs> 